Yeah, good day. Uh, today I've got uh, a little uh, desoldering pump, a solder sucker. A uh, little cheap one I picked up on eBay. Um, comes with instructions on the back on uh, how to use the product. Um, so far I'm reasonably impressed with it. Uh, pops out of the bag without too much drama. Oops, nearly threw it away. Um, pretty impressive. The um, You can actually unscrew them, pop it out. You've got the mechanism inside uh, for cleaning. Pretty pretty easy to sort of do. Uh, not so easy when you're trying to do it from a camera point of view. Um, and then uh, that's basically it. It's uh, reasonably well built. Um, to activate them it's pretty simple. You just push forward. You pop over the top of a, an area that you want to um, desolder. You'd have uh, your soldering iron obviously on it. Once the um, once the temperature is uh, you know, reached uh, melting point and the solder's uh, melting beautifully, just pop aside and press the button there and uh, kicks back the spring. And uh, surprise, surprise, uh, it works. That's it. Not much to say about it. That's, uh, I'm pretty impressed. Uh, I'm going to desolder a component in a, in a moment and uh, we'll see how it performs. Well, I suppose we can get everything set up now, so I'll be back in a tick. Okay, I've got the uh, soldering iron nice and warm. Uh, I suppose I should really get this thing going first. I'll Okay, and what you do to an arm is you simply push that in until you hear it click. It's ready to go, you've got a button to release. So let's uh, see how we go here. I've got to desolder this little thing down the bottom here. Oh, I missed it. Okay, from the other side. That's it, done. Yep, perfect. A bit funny when you're sort of coming in on a uh, strange angle with the with the actual uh, camera and that in the way. It's but you can see it's come out pretty good. It's cleaned it, done its job. Probably not the uh, not the best way of doing it, but it did work.